Hi, Doug McCann of RealityMe.net here. I got a box. Love getting boxes. This box is by DOS Keyboard. Very simple packaging. Inside of it will be the retail packaging. So let's set that cardboard aside. This is the DOS Keyboard Alt 4 Ultimate. Looks like that. Very simple packaging. Pop it open here. Inside of it, we're going to see they've covered the keys up to protect it. And you've got this nice, this is the, the piece that goes underneath the keyboard to support it up. And you'll notice it's a ruler. So on the bottom, it's got a couple of magnets to hold it to the underside of the keyboard. And you've got, looks like several inches. Can't read. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen inches. Sixteen inch ruler goes underneath the keyboard. If you need to measure something, you pop it off. You don't have to use this unless you want to elevate your keyboard a little bit. So let's look at the actual keyboard itself. They've protected it with some foam. Cable. Okay. In addition to the keyboard, there's just your little one-page installation instructions. Requires no driver. Just plug it in and use it. That's it. Nothing else in the box. Except the keyboard itself. So there's the keyboard. And you'll notice they forgot to print numbers and letters on the keys. Isn't <laughs> that cool? So you got a little volume control up here and some things. Now, here's what you got. These are mechanical keys. Let's put it down here. So this is the Mac keyboard. This is a membrane keyboard. This is DOS keyboard, a mechanical keyboard, very similar to um, what we had in the 80s. You notice these are quieter keys. They're not as noisy as your cherry blues. I uh, believe this one is MX Browns. So these are your cherry browns. I didn't get them labeled because I want to easily be able to switch between different keyboard layouts. Maybe I want to have Dvorak one day and QWERTY the other. I shouldn't need to be looking at the keys. Not having the keys labeled um, actually will conceptually make me a better typer. The biggest thing is that this is going to help reduce, conceptually going to help reduce some strain as I do my daily typing. You've got this to lift the keyboard up some if you want. Got a guide right there on the bottom, so it looks like that. And that gives you a slight angle. You've got some media keys over here, sleep, mute on the speaker, volume. You've got three blue LEDs for num lock, uh, caps lock, and whatever the other one is, shift lock, I'm sure. Something like that. Excellent. There it is. DOS keyboard. Even listening to Doug. <laughs>